Hi friends. I hope y'all are doing well. So you probably already know what the video is about LMAOO. Let's respect each other's opinions okay? If you can't accept someone's opinion then. Not my problem. Same, same. Like I cannot with those type of people. Why don't they just mind their own business or focus on their favorite groups? Like what they are expecting? Just because they don't like that group doesn't mean others don't have the right to stand that group. About the fandom thingy, yes I strongly agree. Sometimes I find it annoying when some fandoms are being toxic but I believe every fandom has toxic sides. I was even a toxic fan before not gonna lie. Plus, what some of the toxic blinks did to that one dude, is below the belt. Don't get me wrong, I'm a blink too. But I'm still waiting for the time when all fandoms become less toxic. Also, I'm very happy to know that you love my videos and I hope you're doing well too. I also agree with this opinion because I think it might be bad for the idols who are minors because they might get sexualized for a very young age and that's just so wrong. No one deserves to be sexualized. Also, about the sexual songs and dance choreography being performed by a minor is so inappropriate. I somehow agree to this but I think ATEZ San has also one of the best stage presents in 4th gen male idols. But yes, Yeonjun and Hyunjin's stage presents are no joke. Plus their overflowing charisma is so amazing. Yes, I also saw that on KBUZZ's community post. I, myself, also became a Delulu before but I just can't stand what some shippers do. It's just really funny how some fans overanalyze everything and thinks that there's a deep meaning with what Jenny said lol. Yes, I even thought it will be Ji Young Yeon's era but sadly no and I want justice for Ji Young Yeon. Plus, the teasers are about to spoil the whole song lol and the fact that Jif revealed the dance break before the MV was released is a wrong move in my opinion. This. I just don't get why people keep on saying that BTS and BLACKPINK is untalented or overrated. Please know that BTS and BLACKPINK deserves their achievements. They wouldn't get those achievements if they aren't worthy. I'm not saying that other KPOP groups aren't worthy okay? Don't get me wrong please. All groups deserve to be appreciated. This is similar to the other opinion about BTS and BLACKPINK earlier. Yes. I agree. I also think all fandoms should unite together, so we can stop having fan wars and maybe lessen the haters of every group. But I think it's gonna be impossible at this point because there will always be that group of people in every fandom who will do anything toxic just to get what they want. But hopefully, those haters stop someday. It's G, Idol but it's okay this isn't a spelling below. I like G. Idol 2 more than Red Velvet because I watch G, Idol videos too often, that's why I like them more to be honest. We all have different preferences. So I think that's okay as long as we aren't hating on other groups. Yes. I just dislike it when people keep on saying that it's just a media play whenever an Idol X Idol is confirmed dating or something. Idols have feelings too, they are not robots who doesn't feel anything. I have a mixed thoughts about Irene being overrated I just honestly don't know if I should agree or not. It just feels like she's overrated but I think it's just because she's the most well known Red Velvet member I guess. Ahem excuse my stupidity. Also about the stylist incident, I didn't know what to feel too because I think I have no right to judge both sides because I didn't even know what happened exactly in the whole situation. But yes, we are all humans and we make mistakes. And yes we love a good leader. I disagree about them being overrated. I personally think they deserve all the appreciation they get. But I do think that some people just started to stand BTS because of their visuals and they are a little bit overhipped. Sorry but I think all of them are great in their own way. But if that's your opinion, then I respect your opinion because people have different point of view. I don't think so. It will not lose spot from the big three just because Blackpink leaves. The big three played a big part in the KPOP industry. If YG's rank fall of because Blackpink leaves, it doesn't matter. YG is still a part of big three. 
I also read an article where it says that the big three is unchangeable. So yeah, I'm still not sure about it though. I hate to say this because it feels like I'm being rude or something but I do think Anhippon is kind of flop but who knows? They might be bigger in the future. I also agree that BTS couldn't be recreated ever again because BTS has their own strong points that no one else can recreate. Yes, that's what I think too because JYP has many well-known artist groups that would totally help increase their sales. But I'm still not sure though if JYP will outsell the other three especially Big Hit. Big Hit outsold the big three but I don't know if it will continue in the future. That's what I think too. So I hope that they renew their contract and get a chance to be the biggest GG because they truly deserve it. It really depends on how IG will manage their new girl group. But I feel like the majority of the fans that girl group will get is Blinks. If IG disbands Blackpink just to focus on the new girl group, people would dislike the new girl group and it can be a flop. But I wish IG will manage their artists and groups better. They can sing. They might not have the best vocals but most of them are good at singing. We all have different taste when it comes to music, so I respect your opinion. Thank you.